Hey everybody, uh, Dolonim here, bringing you a crash course video on how to heal as the monk in World of Warcraft. And in this five minute video, I'm going to go over the rotation, pros and cons, and talents that will help you be a pretty solid monk healer. So, let's go ahead and get started. Alright guys, so to get started, I'm going to go over the talent tree, so that if there's any extra abilities there, you'll be able to see them. I like to personally go a passive tree, that way I don't have too many castables. Uh, Mistwrap is a favorite, mostly because, like I said, it's passive. Um, it does increase the duration of Enveloping Mist, which is a very good ability. Um, next up on the tree, it's going to be Tiger's Lust, just makes you go a little faster. Life Cycles reduces the mana cost of the next Vivify, and Enveloping Mist, which is huge, considering they can cost 600. It's a hefty percentage of my mana pool. Next is the standard class, get away from me, enemy ability. I go with Ring of Peace because it's always fun to see in PvP. Healing Elixir for when you're getting low. And what I don't have yet, but I would get, will get when I hit 90, is going to be this Jade Serpent Statue, which will heal the same target that you are currently using Soothing Mist on. And speaking of Soothing Mist, that is the main ability in your whole rotation. You're going to be finding yourself using Soothing Mist half the time, more than half the time. And so basically what the rotation consists of, it will be Soothing Mist, followed by, depending upon the situation, Soothing Mist is good to throw in a Vivify. If they just need a quick heal and you can move on to the next person. If they're kind of low, I usually like to throw in an Enveloping Mist on them, because it'll add a nice heal over time onto them increases all of their healing gained from the monk. That way you can throw in a vivify after that if they really need it. And Renewing Mist, I like to just tag that onto the DPS. Honestly, that is the main rotation. Soothing Mist, Renewing Mist, Vivify, Rinse Repeat, throw in Renewing Mist every now and then. Do not try to use Enveloping Mist or Vivify without first having Soothing Mist on the target or else you'll find yourself wasting a bunch of time and that won't be good especially if you're in a tight situation and your DPS like to take damage. Extra abilities that you can throw into your rotation as needed are going to be Thunder Focus T gives a lot of extra bonuses. I personally like to use it with Essence Font which will incent essentially just increase how fast it goes out so I'll use my Thunder Focus T throw that as Essence Font it's a very good ability to use while you're on the move with your group it's not the strongest, it does leave a heal over time but I like to just throw that on because unfortunately as a monk you can't really move and heal, you can maybe throw in your heal over time got essence font other than that nothing too much you can really do oh, you can detox but okay another ability which I'm a big fan of but has a hefty cooldown is revival which heals everybody and clears them of debuffs it's a nice chunky heal too so 1600 it's at least 10 percent of my health pool and just removes all debuffs that can be dispelled and it's a nice little heal to throw on your whole group if they're missing a nice or a little amount of damage. It's up to you depending upon how you do your rotation. Pros and cons about the monk healer. Mobility is good for a pro. Another pro is it has very strong heals. Single target is its strong suit. Vivify heals targets nearby. Cons would be mobility. It's both pro and con because you're pretty much limited to the roll and running as fast as you can. If you're just in the nick of a fight so I was just killed by a very mean, mean horde bear. Anyway, the final con, the final con, that's my dead body, is that there, to me, feels like there's only one last resort kind of heal, which is the life cocoon, and you'll throw that on, they'll get a damage shield, and increases the healing they get. It's great. Two minute cooldown, it's kind of difficult to throw off multiple times in a single fight. And so that is how you heal as a monk in World of Warcraft. 
Thanks for watching.